them police. Hello! What is up, guys? That was a bit much, I'm sorry. Hello? It look like uh, work attire. Don't you be judging my sandals. Look at this. Clapped. God, what is going on over here? This is new. I have no idea. What? Jumps are destroyed. Dude, Dad just took out the bobcat? I guess. My goodness. I don't know. I have no idea why. All right, fair enough. Um, yeah, what are what are we doing today? We're gonna work on the trailer. He says we gonna work on. The Nobody wants to see that work on ball. The bike. Shit. Jeez, bud, trailer's already restored. It's gonna be dropping them axles today. Dropping axles and in there, uh huh. Every time you do that whistle thing, I just think of the one video where it was like, it turned into a poop for like half a second. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, but some uh, carport repairs. Yeah, carport's falling apart. Jeez. Yeah, I just like opened the door one day and this whole thing just like ripped. We need a real shop. I think so, and some real land. Oh, how about my boss? like? He wants to buy this, like, he wants to buy, like, 75 acres in West Virginia. He was, like, trying to get me on board with it. I told him about the idea of, like, renting out campsites and, like, making a, uh, making a quad trail, like, rental place. He's like, I'm, I'm, my, my mortgage is about to be paid off. I'm going to rent out my house for 800 a month and I'm going to buy land in West Virginia. Yeah, he's, like, trying to get me to come, like, take care of this land with him or something. Might have to. How's the CR coming, bud? Well, all I did was take the engine out of it, so there isn't an update, really. I thought a piston was coming in the mail. I've had the piston for a while now. My apologies. I still think I need a thicker gasket, though, because I, I ordered another base gasket. Just double up. I am, but it's still not going to be thick enough, I don't think. Triple. I'm have to find another one. Triple up. There's... Oh. Bud, someone just drove by with the dual support. Woo! <laughs> yeah, was, Who's uh, doing a peel out here? What the hell? Jesus. I think people are visiting us, bud. So yeah, some kid on the dual sport just drove by. Might possible quad racers fans. It looked like he was uh, really checking out the area. We should go. Let's ride down there, bud. We'll go see if he's on the trails. <laughs> oh, yeah. Front flip. Uh, I really don't think this thing's meant for jumps. Uh, I don't 
think so either. Oh, it drifts. owns this or if it's just like Where's that guy Can we make another weird circle track around that oh one god we have some really sketchy jump like over the montour oh, yeah we hit that hill climb up there come up through here uh, you like jump into the storage hole. that view the best. look at the way you can see the power lines go all the way down there i want to just ride down It just ruins the plate <laughs> every single time it bottoms out. <laughs> My gums still hurt. It was a little strange. Uh, while I was gone camping, uh, what, what did the haggler do? I don't know. I guess he just quit. He just I don't know. It sounded like he just quit quad racers, but we're not really too sure what's going on anymore. And kind of losing track of people. Ch channel might be falling apart, guy. What's going on. Who knows, honestly. Oh, God. Watch this, good as new. Yeah. Might be a little low on gas. A little low on gas. But hey, that's what the reserve tank is for. That's probably why you have so many issues. Every time you drain the tank, it sucks all the shit in the bottom into the carbs. <laughs> I'm trying to go to the fucking Chinese buffet. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, guys, are you ready to take a journey to the Chinese buffet? Woo! It's one of our favorite places to go. All kinds of great food, great atmosphere, amazing deals. Maybe pick up some gas on the way back and then I can ball on this thing. Mechanic says that the XT600 has more, well, it has a better top speed, I'll give it that, but this thing's, oh. this thing's beating it off the line. Nah. Allegedly, the Raptor has 38 horsepower, and this has 45. See, I couldn't I, find no, any good sources for the horsepower, but everyone says 38. I don't know. And I this, thought I the read actual so specs for this says 45. All right. So. Well, I still think this thing's geared like it's gonna have way more torque. What? The Raptor. Nah. Oh why hell! Would it have, it? Why would it have more torque? It's a race quad. Not really. It kind of, I mean, it kind of is. I wouldn't call it race ready, but it's geared like a race Not quad. They would give the quad any more torque than the street motorcycle. All right, well, we're going to get some gas in but these. I think on asphalt, this would be it, but this would beat it with the traction. I think this, okay, I, I'm saying this would be, have a way better like zero to 50 or 60. And then this thing would pull ahead because it's geared so high. Comment below, what do you think? Oh, bud, what you got there? Here you go. Hey, well, we're just putting vests on now. I guess. All right, guys. Um, to keep uh, some of you um, happy, we're just gonna wear safety vests for no reason at all. We also got some safety belts in here. Got two, bud? All right, we're doing this safe. 
just like yeah we're like so into it we're like these really safe riders and Tannic wimped out he says two vests is too much well I guess it's just me Shut it down, let's go home. What the hell? I looked it up. I looked it up on Google too and it said it was open. Shout out. Shout out. There's little Caesars in the Kmart. Fuck it, let's go there, save some money. That Kmart's empty anyway. We'll ride the bike through Kmart. Take it up on the curb, bud. It looks like tools wearing helmets. What? It looks like tool bags. <laughs> it's a social experiment. Doing some quick shopping in Kmart here. Really see a apocalypse simulator. Yeah, look at the stuff that they have on stock simulator. here. Stuff from like the 80s, I swear. This is actually a good deal. I kind of want one of these just to have it work. Oh, yeah. Going to work, pick up some eggs on my seat. Look, the place is falling apart, ceilings coming down, lights are out. It's pretty bad. But they're well stocked and business must somehow be booming. I can't believe how cheap this stuff is. Like $24.99. <laughs> yeah! Everybody's always texting and driving. Welp guys, just got back to Quad Racers HQ here. Pretty solid ride on the dual sport. Uh, pretty solid lunch at Little Caesars. Not really, but uh, yeah, what, uh, what, what's going on here, bud? So guys, you've seen this trailer. There was a short clip of it in I think the last video. Um, but we haven't really explained it all. Pretty much we pulled this out of the woods. It's a, it used to be a 14 foot equipment trailer. Um, it was a, converted into a car trailer and now we're trying to convert it back into a quad, quad trailer. Quad hauler. We've had so much problem with transportation in the past, but this should solve that. We got a coat of primer on here right now. We're gonna put another coat of black paint on it. We wanna go somewhere, go to Wellsville, have all you guys come out, you know, we'll. We'll do a cookout, nice ride, you know, whatever. Oh yeah. But we need a nice trailer so we can bring all of our stuff, have everything we need there. What he's saying is as soon as we get this trailer done, uh, we will be squared away for all, hauling all kinds of stuff to Wellsville, which means a meetup. So let's get to it and drop some axles in India.
Fix sweet sauce. Nah, this ain't the Chris Fix sweet sauce. Is it better than his sweet sauce? No, nah, it's pretty good, but I just ran out of mine and I don't feel like making it anymore. Boy. Oh yeah, they're on there. It's the same thing on the other side. It took uh, five minutes of bolt. Threading itself as he goes. That's insane. Yeah, I kind of wish we had some oxy acetylene, but we don't. We just have this badass impact gun. $400 Madco. Couldn't get that one out, bud? Huh. Dude, look, that axle's actually bent. Are you kidding me? Got it from like right here. Oh, I think I see a little bit. Maybe that's just because it's hanging, I hope? Nah, it's not like it's gonna matter, but... It's funny, like, how first everybody wanted to see us wear helmets, and then we wore helmets, and then they're like, what's happening to quad racers? They're wearing helmets now. Yeah. Like, the channel's going downhill. <laughs> you can't win. Like entering another dimension. <laughs> Woo! Press that worked. This axle's about to drop. <laughs> now it's like still hanging on. <laughs> Cough it out. What is, what is this little skin tag on here? It used to be a brace for the fender. Oh shit, about sliced my hand off. Don't put your hand there. Holy shit! What happened to our bridge, bud? Nice to have rear brakes. Time to order a new caliper. It's not the pads, my caliper. The master cylinder just is a little jacked up.
you guys hear that? Here, listen, bud, can you hear that in the distance? Yep. What's that noise, bud? I've had this log shredder going for probably a solid eight hours now, and you can hear it. It's like a mile away, and you can hear it all the way over here, but isn't you have it, people complaining about us riding dirt bikes. Yeah, isn't it funny how society works? Uh, you have a quad or something in the woods, you know, making some noise, a little bit of motor noise. Everybody calls the cops in the area. And then you have a tree shredder with a Cummins motor on it, like screaming all day. Nobody cares, no. And they're tearing down perfectly good. What we were, we were enjoying the woods. Yeah, we were out there enjoying nature. You know, we just ride for an hour. Yeah, we made trails noise, for other people. We this going like all day, every day. Just cutting down trees, making noise. And yet people will call the cops on us all day. I don't know. Someone should really call and tell them about that ordinance that they always get us for. Yeah. Uh, hi, yeah, um, there's this chipper shredder making all kinds of noise, way worse than them quad ricers up on the road there. Um, can you go ahead and arrest them and take their uh, machinery? Here guys, get a load of this. Here, put your thing back on, show them. Check out, out, check out these new shop facts we got. Found them both in the trash. Both are working, not even bad. His was missing a hose, he's already rigging one up. Mine's missing a wheel, I will be rigging one up. Also got this wheelbarrow and speakers. Not even bad, really. Bud, what do you think? Solid trash finds. Oh yeah, solid trash finds. We got a new light bar for the XD600. It's gonna go something like that. Yeah, just an Amazon light bar. It'll look right pretty there. sick up there. Yeah. Oh yeah. And we also put a new sprocket on it. Ooh. Just front? Yeah, put a new 14 tooth on the front. What was That's down from a 15, so I got about a 6% torque increase. Um, definitely feels better now though. With these tires and that sprocket, it's pretty solid off-road. Oh yeah. Doing work. I don't understand how it zaps them. They get attracted to the light and then they go in and then. Yeah, but where's. Well, these metal rods, I bet. One's probably. I don't know how it works exactly, but. I see one's ground, one's. We're just waiting for a big June bug to go in there. Anyway, guys, honestly, um, yeah, whenever uh, we do work like this, uh, it takes longer than we think. But got the axles out, just doing some sanding and prep work on them. A little bit of wiring work. Oh, you guys. Jeez. Bolts were pretty rusty, so it kind of took all day to get them out. But uh, one of these days, maybe tomorrow, the next day, we'll get these all sanded and painted and everything and ready to go back in. Um, we got the plate for the trailer today. The next big project is going to be the wiring, so maybe we'll do a do another short vid on that. Yeah, actually there's a lot of good stuff coming up on the channel. Uh, we're supposedly having a fan give us a pickup truck. Oh yeah. Supposedly, I don't know if it'll work out, but this kid kept contacting us and he says he wants to give us a pickup truck to do uh, some hooning with. Yeah. So that'll be so pretty we'll sick. Get a free truck, that'll be kind of cool for the channel. Yeah, we're trying to work it out right now. Really looking forward to it if we can make it happen. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <clears throat> also, I'm getting another quad here on the channel. That is sort of a surprise. Um, I don't know. Yeah, we'll just make that a surprise in an upcoming video. Channel's not dying. Lots of good stuff coming up. Getting it's ready. Definitely not dying. Guys. Definitely not dying. No, Jeez. we're just getting ready for Wellsville trips. Yeah, thanks for watching. Um, subscribe. Check out quadracers.com for your decal needs. If you guys buy decals, definitely post them on your Instagram or whatever, tag us in it. We'd love to see all that. Oh yeah. So, yeah. I'm thinking we might have to start doing a photo of the week segment. Oh yeah. If you tag us in a photo and yeah, we'll do like a photo of the week segment where uh, we show it. Yeah, if you guys, if you buy our stickers and put them on whatever, just tag us on Instagram. We'll feature some of your pictures on oh, yeah. Instagrams.